three, not this person that I just sleep with every now and again when I feel it. One person has this power. And so when you introduce another person to your soul bond, what happens is both spouses get tied to the spirit or to this person. So now you have a squatter in your bed. You got this squatter. You got this squatter in your bed. They that without your permission. You don't know how long they've been there. You just know somebody has been sleeping. In my bed, in my bed, in my bed. <laughs> what are they going to be in town? I might be there with a hat on. <laughs> Torn apart and ripped from out from under him. Though God promised 
I'm at work. But I, I think I'm going to call someone so at about 5 p.m. I'm going to meet them at the 12th Street in Cermak and I'm about to make it happen. Whew, Lord, and let me think. It's only a Giordano's over there. Okay, there's a bathroom in Giordano's. I can make it happen. <laughs> but why? Because we got to get these things open. And the way the devil knows how he's going to drive you is based on what? Your blood. What happens? Certain hormones are lifted up, and certain hormones are pushed down. And if certain things are lifted up, he knows he can get certain things accomplished and certain doors open in your life. You don't know what's happening to you on the inside of your body. Or who's playing with the inside of your body. Now, also, witchcraft can be introduced to your hormones. When we play with, for with fornication, we actually, there's another door opened up 